Ladies and gentlemen, in just a few moments, the library doors in front of you will be opening. Please stand back from the doors as they will be opening toward you. Thank you. You unlock this door with the key of imagination. Beyond it is another dimension. A dimension of sound. A dimension of sight. A dimension of mind. You're moving into a land of both shadow and substance, of things and ideas. You've just crossed over into the Twilight Zone. Hollywood, 1939. Amid the glitz and the glitter of a bustling young movie town at the height of its golden age, the Hollywood Tower Hotel was a star in its own right. A beacon for the show business elite. Now, something is about to happen that will change all that. Now, on an evening very much like the one we have just witnessed. Tonight's story of the Twilight Zone is somewhat unique and calls for a different kind of introduction. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator, still in operation, waiting for you. We invite you, if you dare, to step aboard because in tonight's episode, you are the star. And this elevator travels directly to the Twilight Zone. You are the passengers on the most uncommon elevator about to descend into your very own
Señor en todo momento y por favor vive a sus hijos. When stormy night long ago, five people set the door down there. That door is opening once again. This time, it's opening for you. of a permanent resident of the Twilight Zone. Ladies and gentlemen, please gather your kidneys and watch your arms, feet and legs inside the elevator at all times. Please take special care to supervise your children. Thank you. Estimados respetes, por su seguridad, una vez a bordo, por favor, permanezcan sentados y mantengan sus manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del elevador en todo momento. Y por favor, vigile a sus niños. Gracias.
one is somewhat unique and calls for a different kind of introduction. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator, still in operation, waiting for you. We